Well, can you feel it? Can you feel the anthem in the background? Gooses all round. It's the Champions League final. The last two games to finish the season. We've got Inter Milan against Barcelona. Barcelona, traditionally on this Sabutio show, seem to do very, very well in these encounters. Inter Milan, though, unfortunately, we had no kit that didn't sort of clash, really. So they are going with the Legion out in 2012, and he attempts to look kind of away kit. So let's just assume El has juice Ronaldo up top. But, you know, it's, it's far stretch for the imagination, but we're going to give it a go. But here we go, Inter Milan. They're going to start the game for us. I'm absolutely buzzing for this one. Barcelona, let's see how they do. Inter Milan, not a great start there. He's, um, but he's, it's going to be a good one. If it's anything like the semi-final between Borussia Dortmund and Barcelona, we should have a fantastic game. Well, it's now though. Suarez moving the ball forward. Lionel Messi just misses out there. Remember as well, I've cut some bits out of this footage, but I'm trying to bring you the whole game as best as I can. So there will be bits here and there that, that seem a little bit slow paced. Uh, the idea that the final should be extended highlights is an opportunity now for Barcelona. Is can he wrap his hand, head around the ball? There's not. Ooh. Uh, not sure what happened there, who took it out, it's a corner ball. Ball played across, he's got himself in a good position, it's well cleared. And cleared too far to Stegen there, knocking it out. Gerard Piquet, oh look at that, R9 nearly taking him out there. Piquet plays it forward in a ball that's gone two quadrants, that's very far for Tika Takabasa. And uh, they're spread out though, they're still spread out from the corner there. There's an opportunity. I believe that's Suarez, or is it Messi? It's not oh, it's a goal! Who scored that one? It's a wonderful finish! I can't read the numbers from there, but he stuck it past him. Oh, what's he called? Handanovic, and that's a wonderful goal. Into Milan now, finding themselves behind. Lots of work to do, oh goodness me, he's gone in hard there. Suarez now finds Messi. Messi knocks the ball forward. Suarez gets a lovely touch, here comes Lionel Messi, can he do it? Oh, it's a good effort, he's ran really fast to get hold of that one, uh, incredibly, uh, incredibly well, well attempted, but look at this Inter Milan now, what are they going to go for? They're playing in the diamond today, uh, is, uh, as I believe that's what they played in the 90s, early 2000s, and ball move forward, look at this, there's an opportunity here, blocked off, what's he going to do with it, is he going to finish it off? Oh, he's missed the ball entirely. Good Lord, PK found himself out of the way. He's played it back to Testegen. He's not the ball across. I think that's Samedo got it on the right side. Oh, there's an opportunity here. Well, what's the conversation about here? Has, it, has there been a slight? Oh, I'm not sure what's going on. I think they've just said, we've got to play on, get on with the game. Who cares? Come on, let's get, let's get on with it. There's only, if there's a slight thing, nobody minds. Here we go, ball coming forward. Uh, blocked him off there and he's blocked him off well. Oh, there's contact there, I think. It's been seen, they're going to play the advantage, and a good advantage it seems to be so far. Ball knocked forward. Found himself the gap. Comes across from the left, he plays it, but I think it's been nudged back, it has done. I uh, do apologise if you heard a message told me, phone's now on mute from here, this is where we do the recording. Ball not one, ball not forward. Tries to block him off. The opportunity arises, touches it one. Ah, nine. Surely he's going to finish from here. Bosh, and he does. It's one-one. What a final we have on our hands here. That's going to be absolutely beautiful goal. That one sneaks it into the corner, and he's back of the net. Here we go now, Barcelona. What can they do? And knocks the ball, loses it in defensive midfield. Oh, De Jong gets a touch on that one. That could be an important touch as he plays it out to the wing. Alba plays it forward. Turn the cameraman. Oh, no, no, no need. Is the ball's come back forward again. R9 gets a touch on that one. I should really learn the rest of the names of this Inter Milan team. Uh, I'm sure I'll print them out at some point. But, ball, uh, what's going on here? Oh, he's got an opportunity to spread out to the left. It's a bit of a heavy touch, though. And uh, not able to catch that one. Oh! And ball played forward, here we go, it's second half, everything to play for, one all. Ball sprayed out to the, to the right hand side, Lionel Messi, Messi, oh, good effort, good block off there by the left back I do believe, 
and then uh, there's a ball in opportunity. Can he shoot? Oh, just past the post. There. So unlucky by Sergio Busquets. Ball played for though. It's all pass here. Opportunity from the right hand side. Has he got himself in the way? He touches it. Oh, it's a goal! It's two one to Barcelona. They take the lead again. Who else but Lionel Messi from the right hand side? He's beaten Handanovic and he's not getting hold of that one. The slow motion replay doesn't do it justice to how fast it is in real time to react with a Sabutio goalkeeper. That is a great finish and uh, Inter Milan got it all to do once again. Fantastic. Oh, that's. Oh, he's, ah, now he's got hold of the ball again. Knocks it forward, touches it one. Oh, misses that one there. There's an opportunity to put pressure on. Misses it though. Key mistake. Barcelona coming forward again. A wonderful bit from the defensive midfielder. Has he got opportunity from the right wing? No, he doesn't quite get enough onto it. And it's played forward into the diamond formation. Oh, the centre back plays it forward. Can I get a touch? Oh, he's given absolutely everything for that one. Flown off his base in the process. Corner ball. And oh, he's just hit the Barca play there. I think to Stegen will get hold of that one. He cleared. Oh, he's made a mistake. That's a terrible error. Surely he's going to score from here. The goalkeeper's out of the box, so he's got to come off it. He's got to come into his line. There's only one way he's going to get back. Plays it. Oh, it's on the line to Stegen. Can he get in the goal? Oh, he tried to get in the goal. And just Stegen stuck it in his own net, trying to get back into the goal so he could become the, the stick goalkeeper again. Once you're out of the box and you miss it, you can be flicked into the goal to then become the stick keeper again. That is our rulings. And Big Chris is just can't believe what a ridiculous error that was. All he had to do was slide the flicking player into the flicking goalkeeper of Stegen into the goal, and then the, the Stegen would have been behind it on his on his on his rod. That's the way we play it anyway. I know some viewers might not agree, but look at that. You can see how devastated. What a what a ridiculous error that is. And Ninta Milano straight back in this game, all because the Barcelona keeper has, has absolutely hashed it. There's two minutes left on the clock, as you can see, or oh, two minutes 40 on the clock, counting down. Barcelona now throwing this away. Have they let Inter Milan in? This game is wide open. It's 2 2. Unbelievably, it's 2 2. Inter Milan playing the ball forward here. They've got, they can sniff it now. They can sniff the blood of the Spaniards. Barca though coming forward again really putting pressure on him knocks it across this opportunity this space can he shoot Suarez oh easily dealt with by the goalkeeper there knocks the ball forward opportunities arising once more into Milan, can they get past? It's a very tight defence. That a three and a three there, and the uh, the right back's a little bit further forward. Can he get round him? Oh, and that's is that deflected for a corner? Oh, it's a goal kick uh, to Stegen now. Is oh goodness me, another mistake there. Good lord, he's uh, he's having problems. Get Victor Valdez back out of retirement. The Into Milan now moving the ball. Got to get it past him. Oh, he controls it well. He puts it in a dangerous position. There's going to be, have to be an opportunity from the right winger. Can he get there? Oh, he does get there. And I'm not sure what the tapping is for it there. It all happens very quick and you forget. But the ball's played back to the goalkeeper. Still sticking with his ticker tacker to the end. Alba gets rid of the ball. He was a left back, wasn't he, Alba? I think he was. I saw him box somewhere. Obviously, boxing with me. But here we go. Coming forward. Opportunities. Well blocked off. Oh, he's touched the ball first. He's definitely touched the ball first before he says otherwise. Oh, the just needs the ball. 3 2. Right at the death. That is an absolutely beautiful finish. He's stuck it on the right hand side of the goalkeeper. So quick, so difficult to react to. Could he have done better? Who was the scorer? I think that was Lionel Messi again. He was with the brace. You cannot write that little man off. He scored one more time. And that's it. I think that's the championship. To stay good coming up. He's absolutely delighted with his striker there. Yeah, everyone's going to forget about that terror. But look at this Inter Milan going down the tunnel. They tried so hard. They played so hard. Barcelona, though, undefeated nearly in Europe. Can anybody stop them lifting the trophy again? Barcelona, champions of the Chubbians League.